My book, Viral Jesus, seeks to answer the question, why are we no longer seeing viral movements of the Spirit in the West? And to do that, to investigate that issue, we're going to look at our history and our theology, and we're going to look at viral movements in the past history, and we're going to try to find out why that is no longer happening. What's interesting to me is that from uh, the first 280 years of the church, we're a viral movement of the Spirit. And then from the Edict of Milan until 1949, that's 1,636 years, we did not see one single viral movement of the Spirit in Christianity. What changed all that was the Chinese house church movement in 1949. Chairman Mao tried to eradicate Christianity from Chinese soil. But instead of doing what he intended to do, he ended up unleashing a viral movement of the Spirit. In fact, it's the most powerful movement of the Spirit in the history of Christianity. So consequently, in trying to eradicate Christianity, he unleashed it. What happened there? Why did that happen? So the Viral Jesus book seeks to analyze this kind of information and, and try to answer that original question. What is it going to take to see a viral movement of the Spirit in the West?